Oh no! Mikey and JJ were enjoying their family vacation when all of a sudden, a huge jellyfish stung them both. After being rushed to hospital, it's up to us to help. Oh no, oh no, this is really bad news. Mikey and JJ, oh, what have we done? Lily, Lily, over here. Oh, hey, Bear. I was just working in the hotel. I'm super busy. Oh, I know, Lily. You built an amazing hotel, but we have an emergency. Come on, follow me. Oh, no, an emergency? Okay, I don't care how busy I am. I'm coming to help. Lily, didn't you notice? Mikey's gone, and so is JJ. They were swimming over by my hotel with their families, and they got stung by a jellyfish. Oh, no, that's so dangerous. What are we going to do, Bear? I don't know, Lily, but they've been rushed to hospital. So we need to get there as quick as we can. What? What is this? Lily, when did you get a helicopter? Oh, do you like it? One of my guests is staying here, and they're super duper rich. How cool is that? They have a helicopter. No way! That's so cool. But, uh, Lily, we're going to take this helicopter, so jump on in. Oh, okay. If it's an emergency... I'm sure they won't mind. Hold on tight, Lily. Here we go. Mikey, JJ, we're on our way. Okay, uh, hold on, Lily. I've never flown one of these before. Oh, Bear, I'm scared. Are you sure you know what you're doing? Yeah, not really, but we've got to get to the hospital. Come on, we're nearly there. I can see it. Can you see it? A big red first aid sign. Oh, I think I can see it, Bear. Uh, you better slow down. We're coming in pretty fast. You're right. I'm slowing down. Okay, uh, just need to land on this helipad right here. Come on, we can do this. Yeah, uh, yes! We made it, Lily. Not bad for my first time flying. Oof, that was so, so dangerous, Bear. Yeah, well, it was a little bit of a bad landing, but we're here, safe and sound. Okay, let's go in and see how Mikey and JJ are doing. Good idea, let's go. Oh gosh, did you find them yet, Lily? Hmm, no, I can't see them anywhere, Bear. Maybe we should try downstairs. Ask somebody at reception, maybe? You're right. We're too high up. We should go down another floor. Come on. Hey, where are you guys? Oh, they've got to be around here somewhere. Keep looking. JJ. Mikey. Oh, wait, Lily. I found them. And their families are here. Oh, hey, everybody. Where are Mikey and JJ? Oh, no. They're in here on the operating tables. Oh, Lily, they don't look too good. Oh, no. It must have been a really, really, really big jellyfish. Oh, that is a bad sting. They're both in a terrible way. We've got to see if we can help. I feel terrible. Hmm, but what can we do about it, Bear? Seriously. Uh, good question. Oh, let's ask the doctor. Ooh, that's a good idea. Yeah, maybe we could help them with an antidote. Good idea, Lily. Okay, let's check. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Doctor. I was hoping if there was anything we could do to help our friends in there. It's Mikey and JJ. They were stung by a jellyfish. Oh, a jellyfish sting. Well, that ain't really my expertise, unfortunately. They're gonna be stuck like this for a while. Unless you go see Tim down by his house. He's a marine biologist and an expert on all things jellyfish. Okay, we'll do that then. Mikey's family, JJ's family, don't you worry. We're going to do everything we can to help get them back to normal. You have our word and we promise to deliver. Exactly. We're going to do everything we can. Now, come on. We better get going. We got to hurry up. You're right. No time to waste, Lily. Oh, cool. This is the ambulance I saw come pick up Mikey and JJ. I suppose that would make sense. All right, Lily. We're looking for a guy called Tim. Any ideas where he might be? Hmm. There was a Tim staying in my hotel, but I don't think it's the same guy. Yeah, probably just a coincidence. If this guy is a jellyfish expert, maybe he lives around here somewhere. We need to find him so he can tell us information about jellyfish stings. Ooh, yeah, that's a good idea. Maybe he lives down by the water. Or maybe he's even working down there. Oh, you could be right, Lily. All right, let's split up, ask around, and find our way to Tim. Ooh, good idea. Oh, check it out, Lily. I can see houses right across the bay. He probably lives in one of those houses. Well, there's no time to waste, and it looks like the fastest way is going to be to swim. What do you think, Lily? Are you up for it? A little dip, maybe? Oh, swimming. It's just, ugh, these are new clothes. Aw, Lily, come on. We've got to do this for our friends. Let's do it. Right behind you. You're a great swimmer, Lily. You can do this. Oh, you're so much faster than me, Bear. I can't even catch you. Here we go. Oh, gosh, I need to come up for air. Oh, oh that's better. Here we go. We're so close. 
Ooh, this is gonna be so good. I hope Tim is here, and then we can help Mikey and JJ. Ugh, cold getting out of the water. But nothing like a nice little refreshing dip. Ooh, that is so true, Bear. Okay, let's spread out a little and see what we can find. Okay, a guy named Tim. Where would a jellyfish expert live? Hmm. Let's ask a local. Oh, there's someone down there at the pizza place. Let's go and ask them. Ooh, maybe he knows who Tim is. Or maybe Tim orders from that pizza place. What if he is Tim? <gasps> it could be. Uh, excuse me. Hi, sir. Sorry to disturb you. Looks like you're ordering a lot of pizza. Oh, that looks good. Lily, we should come back here later. Ooh, this looks awesome. Yep, we're coming here for dinner. Oh, right. Sorry. We're looking for a guy named Tim. Would you happen to know him? Why, yes. I'm Tim. How can I help you two today? Oh, you're Tim? The jellyfish expert. Well, we've got some friends in the hospital. They were just stung by jellyfish outside of our hotels. We need help quick. The doctor doesn't know any remedies. Oh, that is bad. Very bad indeed. Jellyfish stings around these parts are not to be messed with. Now, let me think. I do have a recipe book at home, but... <laughs> I need to finish my pizza first. But you're more than welcome to go to my house and get it for yourself. It's in my bedroom. Be quick and don't leave the door open. Ooh, okay. So it's in your house. That's great. Bear, did you hear? Bear? Bear? What are you doing? Duh. Oh, uh, sorry, Lily. I was so hungry. But don't worry. I had one ear over here like this listening and one hand on a pizza slice. It was easy. I know what we're doing and I got a bite in. Well, I'm hungry too, Bear, but... Didn't you hear what Tim said? What about Mikey and JJ? I did, and you're right. There's no time for pizza right now. You see, Lily, if you can't multitask like me, you're just gonna stay hungry. Aw, oh, Bear, you're starting to annoy me. I'm so worried about Mikey and JJ. Can we please just focus up? Aw, oh, sorry. You're right, Lily. We're looking for Tim's house. Tim's house. Oh, here it is. Ooh, do you think this is Tim's house? You see that sign? It says Tim's house. That's fairly on the nose. Come on, Lily. You're the one messing around now. Let's search the place. So we're looking for a book that has a cure to a jellyfish sting. Hmm, okay. Where would he keep it? Wait, didn't he say it was upstairs in the bedroom? Yes, he did. Okay, let's go. Okay, you check the other one. I'll check this one. Whoa, this guy's got a really nice bathroom. Did you find it, Lily? Hmm. Hey, look. I found it. I found it. Look, it's in here. Jellyfish antidote. Nice. Lily, you did such a good job. Come on, there's no time to waste. Let's go. Okay, let's get out of here, Bear. We found it. That was so quick. All right, if we bring this back to the doctor, he's going to be so happy. Let's take a look and see what's needed. Ooh, yeah, read it. Read it out loud. All right, jellyfish sting cure. Two oranges, two coconuts. Wait a minute. One zombie worm and one secret ingredient? That's no good. What? What's the secret ingredient, Bear? Oh no, we're not gonna be able to help Mikey and JJ. One secret ingredient? I have no idea what that is. But at least we can probably help with the other ones for now. Let's get what we can and bring it back to the doctor, right? That's a good idea, Bear. Two oranges. Okay, this is a market. Let's see, we've got apples, carrots. No, that's not it. Melons? Where's the coconuts and oranges? Hmm. We need coconuts and oranges. Oh gosh, this isn't good. Wait, there is one other marketplace back in the main town. Maybe we should try there. That's a great idea, Bear. I'm right behind you. Uh, oh gosh, finally. We're here at the other market. All right, look around and see what you can find. Mm, okay, coconuts by two and oranges by two. Fishes, cookies, cake, D delicious, but not what we're looking for. Hmm, what about this guy over here? Hey, sir, do you have any coconuts or... or oh, you got both! Great, we kind of need some. It's an emergency. Could we get two oranges and two coconuts, please? All right, sure thing. It's going to cost you four golden nuggets, though. Oh, gosh, I have no money on me. Lily, uh, do you have any money? Oh, bear, you do this every time. <laughs> okay, there's one, two, three... Four golden nuggets. Ah, oh, you're the best, Lily. I promise I'll pay you back. I owe you one. Okay, sir, here you go. One, two, three, four golden nuggets. I'll take those. Hey, what gives? Why did you give them to Lily and not to me? <laughs> he knew it was my money, Bear, so he handed it to me. I mean, it makes sense. Yeah, I guess that does make sense. 
Well, great progress so far, Lily. So far, we've got half of our ingredients. But those were only the easy ones. We still need a zombie worm and one secret ingredient. A zombie worm and a secret ingredient? Oh no, Bear, where are we gonna get a zombie worm? I don't know, I've never even heard of a zombie worm before. It sounds kind of icky. Let's take a look, maybe this map has some sort of information. Wow, this thing shows us the whole island. Whoa, it's so big. Aw, how are we gonna find a zombie worm in all of this? I think we need to put our heads together. <gasps> Lily, I have an idea. Who do you think protects the islands from zombies? Hmm, the police. The police, exactly. Check it out. There's a police boat and a police officer down there. Maybe he knows where the zombie worms are. Oh, Bear, you're so clever. That's genius. Okay, let's go talk to this guy. Okay, you go ask. Um, hello, sir. My name is Lily, and this is my friend Bear. So, we were just wondering, uh, do you know where we could find a zombie worm? Zombie worm, you say? Well, there are caves of zombies below the prison, but that's off limits to any civilians. Police officers only. But I do recall mention of zombie worms in the earth down there. But, you know, you're not allowed to go there. So, tough luck. And don't even think about it. Oh, okay, officer. We promise we won't. Oh, gosh. Now what, Lily? Oh, we've hit a dead end, Bear. Shh, shh, Lily. That was just a distraction. I actually have a plan. <gasps> you have a sneaky plan. Oh, it sounds so sneaky. What are you planning? It is super sneaky. But we have to do it to help our friends, Mikey and JJ. Okay? Follow me. Okay, I'm right behind you. Well, Bear, are we gonna get into trouble? Not if we don't get caught, Lily. Just shh and come on. But it's the police, Bear. I'm scared. Yeah, but don't you want to help Mikey and JJ? Come on. Yeah, okay, okay. I gotta be brave. Okay, just this way. If we're gonna go to the prison island and only police officers are allowed on it, we're gonna need some police disguises. <gasps> we gotta dress up as police. Oh, okay. Good idea, by the way. Right, exactly. We've got to find our way inside this boat and steal some police outfits. Oh, we're adding breaking and entering into this too. Oh no, we're in so much trouble if we get caught. You're right, but there's a door right down below me, Lily. I'm going to get in. I'm right behind you, Bear. We made it, Lily. We're in. And check it out. Police outfits right here. Shh, keep your voice down. What if they hear us? Oh, you're right. Sorry, Lily. we got to be as quiet as possible. Get your disguise on and let's get going. Oh, cool. We got batons too. Here, you can have a stun baton. Ooh, what does this do? No, I don't know, but save it for the zombies, okay? Ooh, okay. You got it, Bear. Okay, do we look good? Do we look ready to go? Hmm, but the prison island is over this way. We can see it out the windows at the front of the boat. Okay, I think this calls for more swimming, right? I think it's our best bet, Lily. We do not want to steal a police boat. And we don't want to get caught on land wearing police outfits. We'd be in so much trouble. Oh, that is true. I especially don't want to be in the water for too long with a rogue jellyfish on the loose. Oh, gosh, that's true. Swim as fast as you can, Lily. We're on our way to the prison island. We're here. Here we are, Lily. Prison island. Oh, whoa. Look at the size of those walls. They're huge. How are we ever going to get into this place? Well, I don't think we have to get in necessarily, Lily. I think he said there was caves underneath the prison. Do you think that they're keeping this zombie worm prisoner? Or do you think its natural habitat is downstairs underneath the prison? No, I think it's just zombies living underneath the prison. I don't think we have to worry about that, Lily. I don't think it's a prison for zombies. <gasps> But what if this is a prison just for zombies? Oh, that makes it so much scarier. Oh, no. Okay, stop, Bear. Stop. No, that's it. I'm going home. I can't do this. I'm too scared. No, no, no. It's okay, Lily. Let's check around the sides and find a way in. We're looking for a cave or any kind of entrance that looks like we can get underground. That's going to be our first option. And uh, our last one is trying to break into the prison. So <laughs> let's hope there's no zombie prisoners at all. Ooh, I think I like your idea about the underwater caves. Yeah, but I haven't seen any yet, Lily, so I'm getting pretty worried. But let's keep searching. We're not done yet. Remember, try not to let any guards see you. We've got disguises on, but we've got to explain ourselves. We are not meant to be here. Oh, that's so true. Okay, I'm right behind you. Keep your eyes peeled for any signs of zombies in the water. Lily, down here. I found the cave entrance. Oh, no. Lily, there's a horde of zombies coming. Let's go, Lily. Get your baton ready. Oh, no. Ow. Oof. Ow. Ow. 
Watch out! I'm right behind you, Bear! Wow, this police arm is really strong, Lily. Oh, it's super good! Okay, let's get these zombies. Oh, I feel so bad. We're going into their den to steal their zombie worms. But they're zombies after all, so they deserve it. Yeah, and we gotta think about Mikey and JJ. We're helping them. That's true. We've gotta get them better. We're the only ones who can get the cure. Whoa, look at this place. Ooh, okay. So this is an underwater zombie cave. Ugh, it smells kind of funky. Oh, yeah, you're right. It smells terrible. But I can't see any worms around here. Can you? I thought this was a worm, but it's actually just a zombie's arm. Oh, gosh, this place is so freaky. Wait, Lily, aren't worms always underground? Maybe we should just dig. Through the mud? Yeah, I guess so, Lily. Aw, but my new clothes. Ugh. Okay. Time to get our hands dirty. Wait a minute. Lily, look. Oh, what is it? What is it? It's a zombie worm. We did it. Yes, we got it. Okay, we have the oranges. We have the coconut. We have now the zombie worm. Which means we've only got the, oh no. Ah, uh, the secret ingredient. That could be anything, Bear. It's a secret. How are we supposed to guess a secret? Well, I think we've got to make our way back to Tim. He's the jellyfish expert. He knows what this secret ingredient is. Ooh, yes. Tim will know. That's such a good idea, Bear. Okay, I'll race you there. Okay, remember, we're still in disguises. we got to be sneaky. Oh, Tim, you're here. Great. Uh, we just have one quick question on this jellyfish antidote. It says here we need one secret ingredient, but we have no idea what that is. Can you help us? Um, secret ingredient. Right. We still don't know what it is. Sometimes it just washes ashore. I believe your best bet would be talking to the fisherman by the fish market. That's where I usually get it from. And, uh, quick question. Why are you both wearing police outfits? Oh, uh, the police outfits. Um, <laughs> um, it's just like a part-time job. Yeah, a part-time job. And, uh, we're on trial. And, uh, yeah, so we gotta go help our friends. So, um... Bye. Uh, right. Bye, Tim. Oh, Lily, we forgot to take off our police uniforms. That was so silly. We could get in so much trouble. Oh, I don't like lying to people, Bear. The web of lies. It's gonna get tangled up. Well, for someone who doesn't like lying, Lily, you did a pretty good job. That was super convincing, right? Yeah, it really was. Okay, so Tim said it sometimes washes up on the shores. And we need to go talk to a fisherman about it. And wait a second. There's a barrel of fish here. And there's a fish in a barrel here. This looks like where they keep their stock. This must be the fish market. Oh, yeah, I think you're right. That makes sense. I mean, it's right beside the sea. There's lots of fishies here. That makes so much sense, Bear. Okay, well, if the secret ingredient washes up as part of their catch, it could be in any of these barrels. Uh, so let's check the crates. I don't know what we're looking for. Ugh. Ooh, okay, I'll check. Hmm, uh, raw fish. Ooh, uh, what is this thing? So I guess let's look for anything that looks odd. Ugh. Ugh, what is this thing? I have no idea. That's gotta be it though, right, Lily? I mean, look, it doesn't even have a name. Ew, that stinks, bear. Ugh, it's stinky and sticky. I don't like it, Lily. But I think this is it. Great job, Lily. This has to be the secret ingredient. Yep, I think so. Oh, I feel so bad for Mikey and JJ that they're gonna have to drink this thing. Right? Oh, I know. But if it makes them feel better, then it's good medicine. But Lily, before we go back to the hospital, we've got to ditch these police outfits. Oh, really? We're just gonna leave them here? We have to, Lily. It's for our friends. <laughs> okay, whatever you say, Bear. Okay, we've got everything we need. Uh, why do I have rotten flesh? Ew! Uh, right, stock check. Lily, do you have the coconuts and the oranges? Oranges and coconuts. Here, do you want to take them? Yeah, throw them over. Let's get all the ingredients together. Two oranges and two coconuts. We did it, Lily. Let's hurry up. Back to the hospital to give them the good news. Hey, Doc. Great news. We got all the ingredients for you. Everything that makes up the jellyfish cure. See? Coconuts, whatever this secret ingredient thing is, a zombie worm, and two oranges. What would you like us to do? Yeah, well, great to hear, but I have no idea. Oh, that's not good. You're meant to be the doctor. I suppose we'll try mixing them together, Lily. Maybe that makes the cure. Let's try it. Oh, I don't know, Bear. What if we mix it up in the wrong order or something? And it gets messed up and, like, it turns them into jellyfish or something. Oh, Lily, this is an antidote. I don't think it's going to turn them into jellyfish. Come on, let's give it a go. Well, I'm confident. 
Okay, here goes nothing. Okay, go for it, Bear. I trust you. All right, uh, I've done it. And I've got a bowl of some kind of liquid. Lily, I don't know what it is. Jellyfish cure. Yes. Whoa, yes. It worked, Bear. Okay, Mikey and JJ's family, we're going to give them the cure. And everything will be back to normal. And you can enjoy the rest of your vacation. All right, Lily, let's do this. We did it. Go, quick, give it to them. Okay, Mikey and JJ, this is probably going to taste awful. But this is your best cure. I promise you're going to be just fine. Here we go. Mikey, JJ, you're back to normal, and we're so glad you're out of the hospital. Oh, this is so, so great, Bear. I'm so impressed with you. How did you mix them all up correctly? Lily, it was teamwork, and we did what we needed to do to save our friends. You're a genius. You made the right antidote. All right, everybody. Who wants to go and get pizza? We found an awesome spot. Follow me. Oh, me, me, me.